Well, as long as the fishing doesn't blow nearly as much as the wind has this week, we should be just fine today. What's going on everybody? My name is Brian. You're watching Angling Anarchy. It is our last day unfortunately here on Eagle Lake in northwestern Ontario. We're staying at Cold Grove's Eagle Lake Lodge. Lovely little place to stay if you want to come up here and chase big Eagle Lake muskies. Uh, and I hesitated when I said big because we haven't really seen many uh, big ones uh, in, the, in the net anyway. We've got a 48 and a half uh, so far this trip. We've seen some nice fish out on the reefs, but man, sometimes it's just hard to get those reef fish to hit. So we've been targeting uh, some weed spots. So that's the plan for today. We're going to hit a couple rock spots right off the bat, and then we're going to go, uh, usually we'd be throwing bucktails in these weeds, but that hasn't seemed to work a ton. We've been seeing a lot more fish on dive and rise like Navins, um, Medusas, ripping them through the, the weeds, Custom X, uh, Minnow Baits, that sort of thing. So that's the plan. We're gonna get at it. Hopefully we can get a muskie. Oh, little muskie. Oh, geez. Real little. I'm almost kinda glad I didn't hook him. Yeah. yeah, I mean, that was like a 30, a 30 incher. Had the bait at the at the boat just for a, a heartbeat. He actually had it? Yeah, he went up and actually mauled it. <laughs> that's not a sign of uh, what moving today. I know. Yeah, it's by far the smallest muskie I've ever seen out here. I mean it was tiny. You got just a glimpse of it. I actually didn't feel bad about not catching that fish. That's not worth the hassle. I got the sear, good enough. Shit off oh, there's, there's a muskie, another little one. Just a little rocket shot at it. Just did the old rocket up and just kind of, you know, stopped. Didn't go for it. Yeah, the very end has been pretty decent. Yeah. There's fish. I don't know what it is. I think it's just a pike. Yep, Mr. Pikey. Huh. There's the obliterator. Yeah. yeah. At least he just got the hooks. Yeah. Roll. Jack. Not what I was looking for. Yeah, I've gone surface crank rubber with my three fish. Fish, that's a good fish. Yep. Got off, that was a good fish. Really? Dude, this is right where that big one was. That was a, that was a big fish. That was like setting into a wall, Brian. Uh, like we were literally right inside of that. It, it went shake, 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 and all of a sudden nothing. I thought it was running towards me, so <laughs> I, I just hit the hammer to it. Yeah, that was our muskie, I think. We got COVID. Took Fish. That feels maybe better. I can't tell. Oh, it's a big pike. That's a bigger pike. Oh man. I was hovering. <laughs> I know, I felt she's definitely more solid than uh, the average pike in here, but uh, 
Not quite the muskie we're looking for. There is, I think, mine are the muskies because I raised a muskie a second day. Oh, for sure, yeah. Yeah. All right, what are you going to do? Oh, it fell right out. Okay. Nice little pike. Get the day started. Go tell the muskies to stay hooked. <laughs> you know what it is about down here, but it's just different. It shouldn't be. It should be exactly the same as the rest of it. I knew I, I felt them nip it. <laughs> That's a nice pike though. Yeah, 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 I didn't want to catch them though. Oh, here, I'll hold on a sec. You saw my bait almost run out of the water out there? Yeah. Because I he hit it, so I ripped up. At least he just got it on the beak on the outside. Oh, he's almost out. There we go. There she goes, okay. Easy release, nice yeah. little pike. Oh, that was a big fish, Jay. Oh, he's down there. He's down yeah. there still. I hope that's not the one I lost, Brian. I hope that's not the... Ooh, ooh. He came at it again. If that's the one I lost, I will cry. No, because we're further back, dude. Wow. He right. made a hard shot at it out there. Did you see it? I just saw it not take a hard shot. Oh. I just saw him go low. He rolled right over it. Yikes, dude. That was wild. Um, I wonder if we should back up a little bit. Oh, <gasps> there he is, there he is. Oh my goodness, Jay. That's a nice fish. Yeah. <laughs> Wowza, okay. Got her to do a little turn on her. So we're back on muskies maybe and away from the pike hopefully? <laughs> I don't know, but I like the idea. I mean, I know you're down a little bit, but you went back to an area where... Well, this is where we got the last fish last night. Okay. Where she is, a fish. Yeah. Oh yeah, dude. Keep her going. She ramp up. Got Ooh. her. I'm gonna go backside. I'm gonna go backside. It's not the same fish, Brian. It's not the same fish. Ready? Oh. Yes. Yes, we did it, dude. We scored. She nipped it. She we just scored. nipped it. I know. I know. Finally, she ate the same fish, but she just nipped those back hooks. Yep. <sighs> okay. I think I should wear a glove on this one. <laughs> oh, she. That was cool, dude. That was, a, that was a marginal. I thought you were going to let it sit there, and then she came up, and I saw her head just start going like this, and I was like, I as soon as got I, it. As soon as she got those back hooks, I went down. Cause like, I yeah. gotta, then I just kept her. I didn't want to keep her on camera at that point. I just wanted to do the... Uh, dude, she's still she's still hooked. She still beaked her? Yeah, so you had her beaked She's not good. the same fish. Oh, no. Oh, no. That might have been the one I raised that didn't hit. There we go. She popped herself out. <sighs> All right, well, um, after banging our heads against the wall because we could get fish to follow but just couldn't get them to hit, I just had a big fish swing and miss at a Navin, and uh, a little bit further down the weed edge, Jay had this one come up and 
just barely nip. It was just barely hooked. So we got lucky on this one. So let's take a look at it. <laughs> yeah. Pretty iridescent green. Nice fish, dude. Hang on tight. Oh yeah. Yeah. Forty and a half. Forty and a half. Nice, dude. That made my day. Yeah, that was a pretty cool eat, man. It's one of those 50 50 fish when they start grabbing it back hooks like that. Yeah, it's a matter of quarters of an inch at that point whether they get that back hook or not. There she goes. There she goes. Love is a good idea. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what do you say, Jay? I can go home happy if that's how it ends today. <laughs> that was fun. But we still got some time. We still got some time. Let's see if we can get another one of these things to behave and actually hit a bait for us. There's a fish. Oh yeah, nice fish. Oh. I'm on. I'm on. Are you? I'm off. I might be on still, Jay. Yeah, she is. I just had a, a think I had a muskie on too, Brian. She's still chasing. She peeled off. Yeah. I just lost a fish out here. Wow. I never saw mine. How did we not get that one to hit? I don't know. But I'm sitting here fighting a fish trying to watch you. How big was it? I never saw it. Wow. I couldn't tell you. Almost I mean, a musky double there, Jay. <laughs> <laughs> Yikes. Well, that's too bad. Yeah, isn't that funny though? We, we'd come through here and not see a thing in front of this island. Every fish. Uh, might just be a northern dude. Ah. Uh. <laughs> Man. Yeah, it's a nice little northern. Stop it. Yeah. Ah, the joys of filming in the rain. I was hoping that was more of the muscalunge sort of fish, but oh well. Yeah, it's it's something. Yeah. 
See if we can pull one out of the middle of it. Nice pike. Huh? It's it's a pike. Oh. It was a pike. Oh, <laughs> I don't even have a camera on. I do. Oh come on. <laughs> No, he just came out of nowhere. Uh, yeah, unfortunately, I hate going out on uh, sour weather on a trip like this, but it looks like that's what we're gonna do. Um, it's not gonna stop raining <laughs> and it's miserable out here and we have to pack up so that's what we're gonna do we're gonna cut it short uh, the night bite has not been good for us anyway so we are just going to get the boat packed up go make some dinner get ready for the long drive home back to southern Wisconsin but it was so good to get back to Canada I can't tell you how good I mean it's been two years um, not being able to come up here so to get to come up here and uh, stay at Cold Grove's Eagle Lake Lodge again uh, it was just fantastic I uh, had a lot of fun. Buddy Jamie, got to fish with him. That was a, a ton of fun. Nate and his dad up here. Uh, this was just a great trip. Great to be back in Northwest Ontario, sunset country. So, although you wouldn't know it by, <laughs> by the weather here. Uh, yeah, that's it. We got a fish today. Uh, that's Sometimes that's all that Eagle Lake will cough up. This is a tough lake to fish. I don't care what people say. Oh, you get to go to Canada. Oh, it must be really easy. It's not. It's not. Eagle Lake's tough, man. Um, but we made the best of it. We put some fish in the boat. No huge ones. We saw a bunch. So all in all, a good trip. But uh, yeah, we're gonna wrap it up. I'm getting wet, and the camera and Jamie's holding the umbrella over the camera right now, so we can film this. So we're gonna quit right right now. And uh, thanks everyone so much for watching. I really do appreciate every single one of you, and I will see you on the next video.